Hello. Hello, everybody. The most stressful day we had. Today. Hi, everyone. Stressful day. We're not even there yet. Tell us about your day. So I just I finished with my client, right? Can we speak up. I finished with my client at 12:30. I checked my phone because I was saying, "What's up?" And it's like my flight got delayed. So my flight was supposed to leave at 6:50. Get to Seattle at 10 o'clock, and then I had like a 45-minute layover. That shit was delayed like two and a half hours. And then I checked again before I left San Diego. It was delayed till 10.05. The people who are on that flight don't get here till like 2 a.m. So I was like stressed. Was and then he panicking. texted me, he's like, call me when you get a chance. And yeah. I'm at work, and I was minding like, my business. Yeah, I told her, call me when you're free. And she asked why, and I was like, because I'm breaking up. No, <laughs> I'm playing. It's I was like, he what was are delayed. We do? What are we and so do? I was hella stressed. And I was like, guys, I'm going to show up to Vancouver at midnight. Not knowing anything, not knowing where I am. I was like, I should just cancel this flight. I'm not going. I'm I, said, I, call my, I had to call my mom, Pauline, and Delta all within like 10 minutes because everyone kept calling me. I was like, oh my God, what do I do? I was able to find the flight. That, that left, left at, at like three. three. Got to Seattle at like six. So he waited like three hours. Yeah, so I've been here for like three, three and Ooh, a half hours. Kicking it in Seattle. You We got, <laughs> we got upgraded for free to Comfort Plus on Delta. It doesn't focus. You know about that window seat. I like looking at the view. Yay! Things are looking up. I upgraded my seat. All right, everybody, you know what it is. We back here in the YVR International Airport. So right now we're leaving. We literally had a Airbnb book for the last two months, or at least since we know about this trip. Boom, gone. 30 minutes ago, we just changed our reservation to a hotel. Not smart on us. Lost how much? Lost like under $200, but it's no biggie because we can always make money, but we can't always make memories in Vancouver, Canada. So I think I think it's going to be worth it. So we're on the train now, not sure where to go. Okay, bye. Hi guys, so we just got we just got into our hotel and checked in and the front door is right here so immediately when you come in there's like a hallway and then the bathroom is to your left and this is mirror for the fit check fit check fit check and there's complimentary coffee and the bathroom is actually really nice i'm really glad that i came with this because i was gonna bring mine and when you go in here i like it cold so let's turn this bad boy down oh shit 50 Oh, that's the heat though. Whatever. I don't know. And then this is our room. And we actually have a balcony. I'll probably show you guys in the morning because right now it's like you can't see anything. But I mean, it wasn't even locked. Oh, this is cool. And this is the night view currently. It's actually really empty. We It's raining right now, so we got off the train or whatever and we walked like 10 minutes and it was raining and it was pretty cold but you know nothing us Reno alum cannot handle and yeah this is our room and this is our bed oh, sorry, I <sighs> shit I don't open hi guys so we just got back <laughs> from getting poutine we have <laughs> this is the other poutine that we got this this one is the mean supreme from Mean Poutine, Ooh. and the other one is the just a pulled pork. Small pulled pork. Pulled pork Something from like Fritz. Look at all of this fresh veggies. Mmm. Let me try some of this. I'll show you how we have four forks. Mm. Yummy. Mm-hmm. Ooh, cheese pool. <laughs> oh my gosh. Pulling all the bitches. Mmm. 
That sounds good. But we also are eating this one more fresh. Like this mm. one has been waiting in our hands for like a while. Anyway, it's good stuff. Okay. They're both crazy. Bye. Good morning. My eyes can barely open because I literally just woke up. So since it's morning, it's 10 a.m. We went to bed at two, and now it's 10. We're such adults. Like back in my college days, I would not wake up till like 1 p.m. So. Oh, sorry. This is our view. Isn't that so cool? I've never stayed in a place that was like high rise downtown. This is the view. This is like, I know it's like nothing, but I think it's so cool that we're in downtown. <laughs> And then today, what are we gonna do? Okay, guys, so we are done getting ready finally. It's like 1, it's 1 p.m. <sighs> it took me a few hours to get out of bed, but this is my outfit. I'm gonna change these later, but these are for a walk. This coat is Gap. Got it for the Black Friday sale, it was like 60% off, so I got it for like around 100. And this top, it is a short sleeve. Um, and this is from Zara, and it's like a cashmere type thing. And then my pants, it has pockets. These are from Zara as well. And these boots, I have no idea where they're from, but they're so comfy. And I've had them for like four years, and I love them so much. But yeah, so where are your... Where is your pieces from? So these are from Pauline. These shoes, these are Adidas. Uh, Adidas what? Dirty Adidas. Jeans, cotton on. This jacket. Oh really, cotton on? Nice. Cotton on. Okay. And then this, Nordstrom Rack, nice. Black Friday 2018. Yeah. That's it? Adidas. Okay, <laughs> all right. Oh, whoa. We're right across the street from this fantasy factory. <laughs> My fantasies are coming. And we are staying there. It's so cute. It's nice weather to be walking. It would have been cute if we came like in fall. Oh yeah, so we were walking around downtown yesterday and it was like 1 a.m. And everyone, everyone is dressed hack and nice here. Like everyone has like their long coats and like fresh kicks and I'm just like, in like you know house slippers. We were in. We almost went out. Even when even when they're dressed down, they're dressed up. You know what I'm saying? And they have universal health care, so America like wants to charge you for wanting to live some more. <laughs> so I, if I want to live a long life, I just do it here at a reasonable expectation. <laughs> and I can pay to live. <laughs> oh, it's so pretty. Ugh. We're such tourists. I love that for me. <laughs> so we walked like 25 minutes down the street where Destiny, Tim, De Dynasty, Dynasty, Dynasty Dim Dumpling House. And so what we did, we ordered the lunch special. So we got our first part of it. So we got our rice, mongolia beef, mini trees. We got, can y'all guess what that is? Let me, let me know in the comments below. What it is. No, I'm playing. None of you watch this anyway. That's egg and onion. Dumb. Figure it out. And then we also have... Well, we got some Shaolong Dao coming up. If you don't know what that is, go educate yourself, please. We gotta look at the Glen. Look down on the... No, your eyes, not your head. Drop your eyes a little. Okay. I'm staring at your chin. That's perfect. That's where the camera is. Okay, well anyway, yeah, we're getting Shaolong Dao. You know what it is. And we get dessert. This is how the Shaolong Bao came and just so excited. But I only came with three. And we got rice, we got entree, Shaolong Bao, and dessert. We got four things for 15 bucks. If you break it down, it's worth it. It's like 375 with this. Yeah, so that's good. Alright, bye. We're gonna eat. Oh, also, this is fire, but this is cold, so I don't know about that. But this is good. So we're walking to the park, and it's so nice! It's like very pretty. Yeah, I like the clouds over the mountains. Chill out, check out the park, take our time. 
Is it free? To look at the park? To go into the park? Yeah. Sea wall is this way. Is that the one we need to see? Or the, the one we need to fight? Oh, look, there's an old lady. Just kidding, that's a statue. Got all your asses. Love. I'm really feeling these vibes. I really like this park though. Like, like if I lived here, I would run every day. Well, I'm pretty sure, like, we're the, we've been the loudest people in Vancouver the last. I know. Hours. I feel so bad, but we're just naturally so loud, and I don't even think about it. Like apparently, I was, I was apparently I was streaming into the, to my phone yesterday when I was calling, <laughs> but I thought I was just, I, I even thought I was in a quiet voice. That's how loud oh, I Oh, it's so pretty. And these birds, too. Oh my goodness. So nice. Oh. Oh. Do you want to count it down? Yeah. Or just snap. <laughs> what? <laughs> That's so awkward. Okay, ready? Wait, let me stop vlogging. This is so cute. What was this guy? Dun, dun, dun. To you, to the you said enjoyment of people of all colors with a you, creeds and customs <laughs> for all time. Canada is so be nice. Stanley Park. That's so nice. Lord Stanley. Oh, Lord Stanley is the guy that the championship of hockey, the trophy, is named after. You don't sound as excited. You got to be excited. I'm hella excited, dude. This guy was governor general in 1889. It was the 1800s and Canadians still weren't racist. In the 1800s in America, we were still whipping and shit. <laughs> what the hell fucked up? Wait, so this is who the Stanley Cup is named after? Yeah. Because hockey the, originated from Canada? Yeah, the championship is called, like the trophy itself is yeah. called Lord Stanley. Oh. Ooh, this is nice. English Bay. Wow. This is so gorgeous. It's gorgeous! Oh, guys, we finally made it to the totem poles after quite a long trek. We're just looking at the totem poles. Ooh! Are, do these represent like different family? That's, that's pretty cool. So what are these made by like, Native Americans? Hi, sorry, I just have to clean you. There. Oh, dang, the whole squad. Whole squad just pulled in. This is so cool. Oh yes, helps find the family lineage. Hi guys. Hello everybody. More scenic views. See more skyline. Do y'all see this um chevron? It's I'm zooming. I think it uh, gas is up in the boats. How much y'all y'all think gas at this chevron is? Let me know in the comments. <laughs> but this is called oof, this is called hallelujah point and i guess i was thinking it would be so beautiful if it lights up at night with all the cities it is pretty right now yeah it's really pretty it right would now be enhanced if the lights would turn on yes is but because we love canada Vancouver is so gorgeous and I want to live here. It's so nice. It's a gorgeous Canadian. Similar to how Californians keep going into Vegas, I want to go to Canada. There's all Asian people in Canada, so... Yeah, and all the food. Oh my gosh, I should have shown you guys when we were walking, but when we were walking to um, Brecky, there was like Malaysian cuisine and like Cambodian cuisine. And even in Vegas or in LA, like I don't really see that all in one street with like the same like as like Korea Chinese. Town, China yeah, town. it's like like it's when they say it's like Asian thing. food, it's actually like super diverse Asian food and not just the main big groups, which I really love. And Jan wants to read about this. See, I can see it in his Sal eyes. Salvation Army is Canadian Centennial. Obviously. Yeah. Super cute. Super cute here. We are walking through downtown and across the street they have the cutest Christmas tree. It's so nice. Vancouver's Rockefeller. Yeah. Except there's no ice rink. No, there is an ice rink. There was yeah, it's somewhere around here though. Maybe they're maybe they're building it right now. But yeah. Super cute. We're currently going to dinner. Uh, Miku, sushi, Japanese. Yeah, Japanese sushi, 
So I'm excited. Heard a lot of good things about it. Are we crossing the street? Whoa, whoa, whoa. Skirt, skirt. We just go all the way now uh, until we find it. Oh my gosh, another Christmas tree. How cute. How cute. It's the season. Oh, and now it's like super crowded. But not as bad as New York. New York. So now we're here. Oh. And we're here at Niku. It's our anniversary dinner. It's our three month anniversary. So cute in here. So excited to eat. Heard, heard only nothing but good things. Yeah. Hi. Sorry. Good. Have you been here before? No. And we've never been to a place like this before. So my name is Lenny. I'll take you to Curry. Uh, can I give you a quick one quick menu? That we yeah. Yes, so nice. That's our view when we're here. Squeeze? Yeah. What? It's warm. Oh, because the candles are in front of me. Where should I leave them so that we can see us eating? Leave it on the menu. It's too dark anyway. Whatever. Okay, so guys, I try to vlog, but it's too romantic in here, so we'll tell you about our experience afterwards. Party people. This, this is the most unflattering angle. see the double chin. It is so crowded. Hang on. Okay. So we just finished dinner at Miku. It was so good. It was so good. You're so wet. <laughs> it was so good, delicious, wonderful. I mean, exactly. Yeah, it was exactly so the best meal I've ever had. With the salmon. And salmon I'm so ocean. sorry. I know it's hella zooming on my face, but it's raining, and I'm trying to cover myself and my cam. It's a little difficult, but it's delicious. Our server was Lenny. He was Lenny, yeah. awesome. He like comped us our last few pieces of. Salmon. It really came a little late. Ushi. And then he got us a little bit of dessert, which is like this green tea opera or whatever. It takes three days to make. I don't know. Um, and yeah, he was just awesome. He even recommended us a place to eat. Which we'll probably try for lunch. Mm -hmm. We'll probably try that on Sunday. But Miku is the best. Is I, the best. I would recommend. Yeah, that. definitely recommend. I just. We we said we're gonna make it a tradition to come back every year now because it's so good. Once um, a year to Canada. It's just like the shopping area. There's like Nordstrom over here. It's super bouge. It's like it's a miracle mile in Vegas is outdoors. Yeah, I like really love it here. My stomach really hurts though because I ate a little too much, a little too much salmon belly. Well, we're gonna fatty. get dessert. Yeah. It's all yeah. Yeah. So we're gonna get his shoes, and we're gonna get dessert. Oh, what a nice display! Oh, is this Urban? Uh, oh, Nordstrom, Nordstrom. Yes. Oh my God, their Best Buy is like three floors. Jen was shook it. I do appreciate. Yeah. Yeah. Yes. Yeah. Let's rock. All right, we are. <gasps> are they closed? Go go go, go go go. We need these fifty percent off. Oh my god! Did they just change everything? Okay, tell people where we are. Nordstrom, here in like Central Plaza. Yes, and it's so freaking dope here. Oh, okay. This way. It's so bouge. So bouge. So from Nordstrom, we ended up going downstairs, and now we're in like a mall area. I think we're on the opposite side. We're still the same level as Nordstrom. We're just on the other side. Oh my gosh, it's so gorgeous! Oh, it's so festive. I'm not sure how we got here, but we're here. Yeah. 
Oh my gosh, all the lights. I'm cry. Oh my god. That looks pretty. I know. It's like the Bellagio. Yeah. And then outside is where the tree is. Oh, there's an orchard. How did we get here? You want to go back and trace our steps? Or do you want to go outside? That's fine, but how did we even get here? <laughs> well, we, well, we went downstairs and we like walked all the way. It's like, um, like romantic dramas where they like, because the umbrella's so tiny they had to get closer and then they do skin ship. <laughs> Did the umbrella Honey, almost you're not covering me. It almost blew away. Oh my gosh, why is this rain aggressive AF? Oh my sh I'm getting soaked. I'm getting soaked too. Okay, gotta go. It's wet, guys. Bye. So we we made it to Sing Fu Tom. It was actually underground and we didn't know. So, oh, what is this? Oh, you pick a stick and then you pick your fortune. Pick, 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 pick. Okay, what number? 16. 16. They do this in like China. I watched it in the dramas. 16. Yeah, and you grab your fortune. So you get one. Get it. Oh, the top one or just any? Yeah, it's just the first one. Oh. I think I grabbed a kind of them. So that's all the same. Here. This oh. is your fortune. So this is Jan's fortune. You will make some dramatic changes in life for greater good. Oh my gosh, public health. Ooh, because when <laughs> we jump in, it's fun. what'd you get? Seven. Oh, her favorite number. No, I'm just kidding. One. Slave. Even better. Heck of lame. Where is one? Oh, sorry. Here. One. Let's see. Oh, what does that say? No obstacles know. will stop you from being successful in love. You will fall in love with your dream person. That means we're not going to be together for long. Because <laughs> I'm not her dream. Mark? Oh, oh, oh cut, it, cut it off. No, Should I pick it again? Isn't that cheating? I don't like this. Isn't that cheating? That's what you got. Guys, Jans is so good because we were literally talking about how he wants to get into public health. And like, ooh, oh, ooh, ooh. Let me like stuff in there. That's so cool. Yeah, I've never seen that. Okay, guys, I'm gonna try this thing. Mm. Oh, nice. The tapioca is really good. I really like the consistency and the taste, and I really like the milk they use. It's pretty good. I think it was better than I was expecting. Mm. Hey, you got your own drink. Ball hog. Okay, this is my drink. So you that? Ooh. Do I have to stir mine? I thought it's only the brown sugar that you have to stir. Oh, yeah. But I have pink curls. Interesting. Anyway, look at my fortune. It's Halloween. Okay. We did the fortune thing again because I didn't like mine. Ready? It says, you need a makeover. Do are I'm, I'm, what is you talking about? I literally just have it. And I drip so hard. It will bring your confidence back? That shit never went away. Oh, actually, my fi my first one was greatest good luck, so I guess that's good. But my second one was this is good average luck. Awesome. But the first one Jan got was greatest luck, so that's pretty cool. This brown sugar one is really good. Can you try mine and please like it? Please like that it. That tells me it's enough. Oh. oh. I'm sorry. The, the, the strawberry tapioca with the matcha is a weird. I think it's a weird couple. Should have gotten the grapefruit. Dang that wagon. Yeah. Update, we're back in the room and I think I have diarrhea. <laughs> Woo, and oh, I'm damn. 
Oh, nice. Dang, he did a whole flipperoo. Backflip. Yeah, anyway. So, honestly, I think it's probably something from Miku, even though it was so good. There were some things that were questionable. And it's like 10? I think 10.30. It's like around, we got back around 10, and I immediately went to the bathroom. And I don't know how long it takes to digest things, but we had dinner around like 5, 6. And yeah, it was not good. I haven't had diarrhea in a long time, and I don't feel good. So we're probably going to call it a night, which sucks. We had a lot on our itinerary, but, you know, it's fun. Life comes at you fast. Huh? Life comes at you fast. Yeah, and we've done so much. Like, it feels like we've done so much, but at the same time, we haven't done that much. But, like, we've taken <clears throat> in everything we've done. It's nice. Okay, I'm going to have to go to the bathroom again. Bye.